Procast is back, baby. Okay. <laughs> That's. <laughs> That's perfect. So uh, for how long were you a breeder? Uh, well, I've had two litters. So I've, I've had uh, the first in 2010 and the second in 2012. And the first litter, I only had uh, uh, males. So I couldn't use them to... to start my own uh, line and uh, so I uh, the next litter I had uh, five kittens one died after a few days and uh, mm. uh, there was precious one a female so I had my own uh, uh, female to to start breeding with but then I lost my job uh, near home I had a job at 700 meters from my uh, home and uh, then I lost it and I had to go to work here if you were uh, not, not that far away, but far enough for me to say, okay, I, I can't do this responsibly. I can't uh, go home after when when they're a week or two old. I always uh, I used the webcam, and when I saw something, I always could go home and uh, check and go back. The, that was an arrangement I could make with my employer. But yeah, so that's why I I, I stopped, and uh, it's okay for me. I don't think I, I would want to do it. Uh, Maybe when I've retired, but not now. No, um, if you do it, you have to do it right. And it's it's a lot of work and a lot of stress. And uh, it's not always uh, fun, especially when you do kittens or when they get ill or name it. No, yeah, it's, it's, especially for dealing with other like lives, right? It yes, to do, yes. It needs to be done it right. Yeah, so yeah. It's, it's a full-time job, basically. Uh, almost, especially in the beginning. And... Uh, and uh, yeah, uh, uh, when I, I remember it, uh, the second litter, uh, when I uh, I let them be born uh, in a in a bathroom, a bedroom uh, upstairs, uh, to give them uh, privacy and no, uh, uh, not all the other cats that can uh, move around them and about uh, the, when they were uh, well able to to walk around a little bit. Um, do you see the mentioning of top as well? Oh, it's gone. Um, there was there was an, a pop up, but it's gone. Uh, when when uh, after a few weeks, you I, I moved them downstairs, and well, and, and when you see what uh, the re reaction of uh, the mother can be, really, uh, really uh, angry, and uh, she was uh, every time uh, collecting all the kittens and put them back in in the in the, in the cage. And after a while, that 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 becomes better, and it's it's lovely to see all the other cats taking care of the of the kittens. I I had a big cage with it with some uh, so a lamp that gave warmth, and they would all sit underneath it. And the kittens uh, with it, it was uh, really lovely. And you don't have to put it on the television or whatever with kittens. Uh, it's fun all evening, <laughs> just looking at them. But, it, but it's a lot of work, a lot of re responsibility. And no, I think it's okay uh, for me. Uh, uh, it was fun experiencing, but yeah. So um, let me see if I understand this correct. For, for breeding, just as just curiosity, it's normally one male for several females? Or uh, yeah, yeah, no, yo, yo. Uh, <laughs> A breeding male is is not easy to uh, uh, keep in your how home mm. uh, because they uh, yeah uh, they no yeah I I I'm not, I'm not I don't know a a a need worth piss they piss in your house when mm. you're lucky. <laughs> and and uh, it's yeah. not a normal pee but it's a uh, the stinky ones they they spray. Uh, so, uh, plus when you have uh, more than one female, there's always a risk of uh, pregnancy without uh, um, uh, without you wanting it. So you have to uh, either uh, uh, give the, the, the females uh, anti-conception or you can give the male uh, uh, some hormones, but it, it's not ideal. There's some uh, breeders that, that have their uh, stud cats uh, in, in the living room, but they wear uh, diapers or something like that, so they don't spray. Really? Oh, but wow. still, uh, you have to, uh, yeah, you, you always have to be careful that they don't uh, uh, 
breed uh, the females before you want them to either uh, if you have young ones or they're not tested or whatever so it's always difficult to um, yeah and, and what, uh, some will will do fine and some won't it it, it, it will differ per uh, per uh, cat and uh, when you want more uh, studs then you even got a problem and they will probably uh, uh, argue uh, uh, with each other for okay we want all the the girls and uh, so so it and i know my friend has special uh, uh rooms for them I, I i don't think it's ideal but i can understand because it's and then she can put the females with with the, the males for choice but uh, it's it's not the most uh, uh, uh loving life for for a, a male that is uh yeah. So I personally think they should uh, that should be limited to one or two years, and that's it. But uh, okay. uh, so that that that's always a bit of a problem. Plus, uh, then uh, when you want to breed, you have a you have a, a nice uh, female. So you need to look for for a male that uh, and, and a breeder that wants to uh, give of uh, to, to to let her male put on. Uh, so you have to pay for that. You have to test uh, if you want to buy a, a, a swings to where with whom you may breed. The price is uh, high, much higher. I think uh, two and a half, three and a half thousand euros uh, is is, is uh, quite normal. And depending on where they come from, we also have transport costs. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah. Then you have to find uh, indeed a, a right male. Uh, you have to look for a uh, blood type. Uh, when you have uh, uh, contradicting blood types, uh, the, the kittens uh, are, may not uh, drink with their mother for 24, 84 hours. So there are lots of things you have to, to look, uh, look out for. And a lot of uh, breeders also want special colors, special eye colors, and so on. And so <laughs> yes. <yeah. laughs> and there are even breeders that, that breed yeah, yeah. both eye uh, swing cats. So that's, that's... Just for the eyes, yeah. Yes. Oh, now, wow. for me, uh, I, I don't uh, give, a, give a shit on color or eye color. <laughs> Yeah, I, I I must say my first litter ever all is an odd eye. He has is a beautiful odd eye, and uh, uh, most uh, breeders would be jealous, but uh, his balls are click click off. <laughs> but that was just uh, lucky. Uh, I didn't even know that could happen. So it was. I'm, I'm uh, sorry. Why people would be jealous? I'm sorry. No, the the Everall, uh, one of my, uh, he has odd eyes. Yeah, so he's a yellow and a blue eye. So he's oh, special right. for a lot oh, of the this breeders. Oh, so pretty. It's beautiful. Yeah. Yes, it's yes. Just, it was just luck. I, I, uh -huh. I didn't, uh, wasn't looking for that. So it was just pure luck. And uh, a lot of breeders would be jealous, uh, especially with his, uh, yeah, he, he's really a, a, a nice odd eye. Uh, Watch full episodes of the Brewcast on the main YouTube channel, youtube.com slash at Brewfrasca. <laughs>